Good evening folks, good evening Jeremy, good evening KJ, how are you guys doing this fine, glorious Thursday evening, I hope you guys are okay, I hope everybody's okay, and keeping busy and, and happy, what's everyone been up to? Right, we're just in the countdown time, so I'm just going to spend a bit of time just catching up on my tools. Got to the tires, got to get the eggs, got to do all of those business to get the money coming in. I need to change my work clothes. I need to get in work clothes. This is silly. I'm doing this in my suit. That's silly, isn't it? Now we've got a couple of minutes till we go live officially, so make sure you've got those drinks, make sure you're all settled in. I'm ready for a nice chilled stream. So tonight we've got a couple of things going on. I need to do a bit more work. I wanna get everything going. So we've got loads of planks ready for the furniture store to go over there and do some work. Because uh, I'm taking the word of advice from the people in the stream. So they said instead of paying off uncle, get the furniture store and you'll be able to pay them off way quick. So I was like, okay, I, we can go with that. We're going to get the furniture store today. We're going to and do some work in there, see where we're at. Now off stream, all I've been doing is uh, just the other bits and bobs, like just... Uh, so sort I of keeping the farm ticking over, getting some planks ready, drying planks out. I wanted to make sure I had a good load of planks ready for tonight. So I went over and I used the new big boy and stole loads of planks from the people where I know them from. Um, because if you haven't been doing that, I, I really do recommend doing that. It saves uh, a lot of stress and a lot of pressure and a lot of other things, a lot of other things. Hey, Kevin Frost, how you doing, my friend? How are you doing this fine, glorious evening? Like it's been so warm here today. It's been insanely warm, which is uh, which is nice. I kind of like the heat a little bit, even now. Uh, even though I was like slaving away in in the house, just working real life work, and because we all love real life work, don't we? <laughs> How are you, Mr. Jones? Right, so we'll cook all this up, make sure we're uh, we're all up on this. We got one minute left, guys. One and a half minutes. So there we go. Oh, I should stay down like that. Work right, really. Awesome. There we go. Okay, so I need to eat something. So. That'll do perfectly. Right, we've got some food. And we've got some crop we got to pick as well, but I'll wait for them on that. But I know you guys don't get a massive much view. But what I done was yesterday is I went and I I got that mower, the set on mower, and I mowed all this. Now this is eventually gonna become like my little oak field. So I'm going to harvest all of this, cut all the trees down, and now it's beautiful once you've mowed it, because it's like, you can find mushrooms and everything, like, well easy. Like, it's, which saves a lot of hassle and a lot of stress, so that's quite nice. But it took me a while. Like, I think I'm up to like... 80% plus village on my on my cow feed, which is great. I mean, I don't have to do it very much again, but but God, it took me forever to mow through all of this. Like, like talking about this thing, like how how do people been doing it? How have you guys been doing your mowing? Have you been like up and down in it? Do you make us go around in like a spiral? How how do you do it? Because uh. I've been going around, I've started off going back and forward and then I was like, nope, it's taking too long. So I, I turned into the spiral effort. And it seemed to, 
that seemed to do all right and that's that seemed to work so um yeah i ended up just spiraling and spending ages working way into the night getting that done but we're all done now it's push deep and now we've also got this to all plant so Uh, I don't know if the Zushinis are ready to be picked. Nope. But we can plant them, so. So we may as well plant them. Come on. There we go. So tonight, the plan is very simple. We have got to go and start progressing in the game we need to progress in the game we need to hit the nut that thing is really annoying me right there let's get rid of you you're out you're in my bloody way let's clear these two up as well just so we got a bit of space and we can see what we're doing okay so i my apples are green they're not ready to be picked yet which is fine i can live with that okay so today we have got a plan this is the plan that the community guys wanted me to do and that is to head over to here it is the furniture factory okay so we're going to be heading over to there we're going to be purchasing that and we're going to start working on some furniture now like like i said off stream all i have been doing is concentrating if God had meant us to mow grass, he wouldn't have invented flagstones and concrete. <laughs> uh, listen to you while playing No Man's Sky. Nice. I've never played that game. I've always looked at it and been like, oh, should I play it? I don't know. Um, so what I've done is I've basically got these planks here, which are still drying. But they're getting there, 40%. And now all of these planks along here a dry and ready to be used which is awesome and then i have also filled up these ready to go so these things are are all full and drying out so we've got planks for days i've also filled up this ready to go i've also filled up my truck ready to uh oh i need to grab one more so okay i can do that uh, ready to go to the furniture store so we can start making furniture if you were with us last stream you see that we've got the the truck which is the truck that you get uh in chapter three through doing a mission up by here i don't know, I don't know. That's, that's where is it it is up here there's a mission here where you've got to give a uh, hundred eggs 100 apples and 100 milk off the top of my head and then you get that bad boy so we we got that like way ahead of time um we got all the resources to do that quite early which was great but uh so we literally walked over there with all the resource and we were like yeah i love you thank you very much uh, i need one more so that's grab one more quickly Oh, fuck it, I'll just take that one. Now, something I'm finding is, so there we go. Okay, so we've got a full thing of pallets. Let's head on over. How many chapters are there? To be honest with you, I don't exactly know how many chapters there are in this. Like, I feel like I'm still quite a way off the story. We've still got a load of bridges we need to build. Um, and... We have still got a lot of people to go. Let's, let's, let's have a look. So, I want to do that at some point. But before I can do that, I've got to clear out business parties, which is bag of farm. And in order to clear out that debt, I want to buy a furniture store. I have a furniture production site. In order... All right, let's clear that. There it is down there, look. The furniture factory in order to be able to make better money quicker and then 
I can just buy the farm and then hopefully I'll be able to get the planter and all that. Everything's kind of, I really like, uh, hey Bernard, hey Bernard, how are you? Um, I really like how the progression is very, it's not clear. Things are like unlocked when they shouldn't be. Like I should not have that big of fish um, plant the seeds, which you can see on the right side of my screen. I shouldn't have that mission unlocked yet because I have not got the planner. But for some reason, the game has unlocked that mission, even though I do not have the equipment to be able to do it, if that makes sense. Um, so that's a tiny, tiny bit slow, but hey, it's, it's the way it goes. That's the way the cookie crumbles sometimes. So, but hey, so this is the reason why we're doing this. We need to do this in order to pay off the farm. And then once we paid off the farm, we'll unlock the mission where we can get the planter. And then we can go and plant some seeds. Um, 20 plants, 20 trees um, behind the guy's house. Because then once we've done that, we'll get the, the woodcutter tractor. And that thing looks like an absolute boss. Uh, okay, so there's only four chapters at the minute. Right, okay. Thank you for that, Bernard. Thank you for clarifying how many chapters there are um right so yes this is it we are here at the factory so this is what we're buying we're going to buy a furniture workshop so we can then make all the different furniture and then everyone's a winner jobs a winner we will then be able to figure it now the Oh, it's cheaper than what I thought. I was expecting 250,000, but it's actually just short of 180 grand, which is like pucker, absolute pucker. Hey, mother, how are you? It's been a little while. You're having a break from Conan or are you you multitasking, mother? Um, so this is what we're going to buy today. Now, I just want to have a quick look around and see what they've got around here. Now, I'm super excited about buying this. Um, if it's as good as what you guys say it is, then I'm hoping to make my fortune with just this thing. So let's go ahead and buy it. Now, can we... Uh, let's go inside. Let's have a little look around. So it looks like we're going to need some chipboard. We've got a shed load of chipboard, which is great. And then it all gets processed into things. So that's popping the control panel. And here we go. So a double bed is 17 planks. Children's bed, 12, 16, 18. Look at this, like 18. Okay. And then if we go to the tables, Oh, okay. So we can buy, sell all of this. See what they've got for tables. Like loads of things that we can be creating. Loads and loads and loads of things, which is awesome. Right, that's pretty cool. 23 planks. Right, the question is, how big, how do we make our money of them? Okay, so we've got pine, we've got oak, we've got birch, we've got spruce. So we can use all the different woods to be able to do everything. Uh, we can build a refrigerator out of wood. Okay. And we can build everything we need in order to do it. Now, you get the blueprints as you progress through. Uh, multitasking. Winger, winger, chicken dinner. Oh, yeah. I like those dining chairs. I'll buy them from you. Dining chairs. Okay. Uh, let's have a look. So you want these chairs, yeah? Okay. I'll bear that in mind. Coffee tables. Everything. Loads and loads of things that we can build. Now the question is. How much. Do they make out of them? Now, I'm not entirely sure. It would be nice to know if that makes sense. But what we're going to do is we're going to go here. I'm uh, uh, 
hang on, do I have to put them down? Oh god. Uh oh. All right, let's move you out of the way. Let's see if I'm putting you in the right place. Let's go in here and let's see what it's like creating our first. Or we might have to have them in our inventory. We'll open that door for now. Let's see. Okay. So where do we have to put the planks? That's a double door that opens. It could well be there. It could well be by here. I'm not entirely certain. Drop zone the right side of a factory. Okay, so we drop them in here. Okay, right. We figured that out. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Right. Let's grab these. And let's put them over there. There we go. Let's drive around to the other side of the factory. Drop the planks off. And then we can start creating... Our masterpieces, we are now becoming uh, Nope, we can't just drop them off. We've literally got to go into Yeah, so that's to this Bang Bang There we go Bang. We're going to need a lot of oak. I am feeling the oak. So I'm half tempted now. I've got some a decent machine to go looking for some decent oak. Trying to find a forest that's so got a load of oak in it or something like that. And then just concentrate and cutting down some oak and going from there. Right. Let's go have a look. Um, um, there we go. Okay, right, let's go do it. So, open create. Now, I have got uh, beds. I've got some intermediate things here. So, what I'm thinking is... Bang, bang. Order furniture production. You have ordered production of furniture. It will appear on the designated area when done. So do we see any movement here? It doesn't seem like it. I'm not hearing any movement either. I thought we would hear some. Uh, okay, so it is creating a thing. Now I'm going for intermediate production straight away. Because what I figured is, is that, hang on, do I need to turn the things on? No, okay. So that's it. I just kind of leave it now. That. All right. Okay. All right. We'll leave it. That's fine. All right. So we're going to leave that production. I believe that's it. That that it's as simple as that. I just pop them in, and I can go away. So what I might do is take my truck, and I might. Can we see it on here? Because I know when you do the engineer right in. No, it doesn't show me on here. You've got to actually physically drive to the areas. Because I know when you do engineer, I can it tells you what type of tree you've got. 
in the area and I want to buy a forest that's got a load of oak oak would be ideal the problem is that I've got loads of things drying I do have two oak trunks at the minute that need cutting but I don't want to cut them up until I get a load of them and I'll do a big batch of oak at the same time because then I'm kind of like can crush out the oak and just get it done if that makes sense and because oak is the crop oak is the crop now if I go in here a minute you can see the differential in plate prices here so birch is pretty good as well pine is the worst uh, spruce is the second worst and then it goes birch and oak is the best uh, as you can see that bag of prices um so oak and birch trees are what i'm looking for now let's see what this tree is by here this this tree looks a bit interesting that's a spruce Ah, uh, tells you ones you can and can't cut down. Okay, right. We're going to go back. We're going to get our log transporter. And we're going to go on the hunt. I want to find an area that's got some spruce and a load of oaks in it as well. So we're going to go on a bit of an explore, see what we can find. Maybe we'll find some chests along the way. We'll see. I'm not really hunting for the chests. But if there are some about, then wonderful. Um, but if there isn't, there isn't. I do have, this is my area here that we're passing on the left. I do have all that to cut down. But there's no oaks in that. So I'm not really in a rush to cut it down. Once I get the, the planter, I will. Because I'm just going to fill it with oak. I can't, it's really annoying that you have to have so much space to be able to get out of the truck. It's, there we go. Okay, that can all stay there. Where is it? Here it is. So, let's have a look at the areas. So, I obviously own that. That's where the mill is and everything. So, let's go check out this area here. That's six grand. And to get that, I got across the water over there. And now, uh, if it's got a load of oaks in it, I, I might purchase it and crack out the oaks that way. Because uh, I could really do with like the oak is is what you want. The oak or the spruce trees. Now, I'm pretty certain when I go in there and do my engineer, it tells me exactly how many types. How many trees of each type I have. And this kind of looks like a lot of cool little area. It's not far from home. So that's pretty nice. So let's go across the bridge. On my right. It's right here. So if I jump out here. There's some spruce in here. Is this a whole spruce forest? Another spruce. Another spruce. We got a lot of spruce in here. This is definitely a nice spruce forest. Uh, I was right, wasn't I, with my numbers? Uh, no, birch. I need birch. Ah, here we go. So there we go. So we have got one oak. Stop fucking around, will you? Okay, so I've got one oak. Not enough, not enough oak. There's only one oak in there. I don't want that. I want to find a spot that has got a fair few oak in it. I want a nice little oak collection going on. So we're going to ignore that. Let's head over here. And let's see what this area is going to be like. This is going to be a bit of a mission, guys. We've got to find these oak trees. They must be here 
somewhere, but the question is where? I think I'm meant to be going. I guess like turn up here. Here it is. And I'm next to an area here, so that uh one oak. 38 pine, 30 spruce, nah. I ain't doing anything with just one oak and I want... How many oaks would I like? I got some oak there on our right. I don't know why. That's really annoying. But there are... There's, I'm not seeing any... Okay, we're coming up to the next area. It's like each area only has one oak, so they are forcing you to go down the method. <laughs> Two oak in this one. Oak, pine, and spruce. There's two oak, but no birch. Okay, so that's got two oak, so that's a... That's a nice difference. Oh, I can chat. I'll just chat the forest on the left here across the road. Come on. There we go. Nope. One oak in there as well. So we've done these four here. So let's go and check out this one over here and see what we get here. Maybe we'll get a bit of luck down here. So this is part of the game. You've got to go and explore. You need to go and check what each what each forest resource is holding. And try and find that gold mine. Especially once you've got the furniture store. You've got to have your chainsaw to get that. Okay, we've got a birch in here. But no oak. Yeah, it would definitely be easier once you can plant your own. But I suppose until we can do that, we've got to kind of be a bit selective on what we're doing. Um, and to be fair, this is just something just to buy some time while we uh, uh, pine and spruce. No. So that's all these chat and there is nothing. So we're going to follow it around to the end there. And let's go hit these ones over the end here. Maybe we'll find one that's got like five or six oak. Like, I don't know, oak and birch. If I get like two oak and three birch, I'm, I'm quite happy. Like, I just want five trees that are, are relatively decent and worthy of being cut down. And then I'll be like, yes, I'm, I'm on a roll here. But... I suppose it's going to take a little bit of searching. But we will find it. I will find it. There looks like some oak there on the left. Here's the next forest. No, this, this doesn't look too grand. we got a lot of dead trees in here. Uh, pine, spruce and trunks. So that's rubbish. And let's see what this one offers. This one looks pretty rubbish as well, actually. One pine spruce and dead trunk. Nah, I got nothing exciting in there. Okay, so we checked all this. So now we're going to double back on ourselves. We're just going to scout these lot out. We'll just scout these out and then head back on. And we'll see what we're looking like then from there. Um... But oh, we'll go for it. Like, and then we'll go and see how much money we're actually going to make from a load of beds. We're going to sell the beds. They're all pine beds. Uh, so not major income, but meh. Uh, in the northeast. Up here then. Around here, these guys around here. 
Okay, well, yeah, they've got some big money for us over there. Maybe we'll, uh, we'll swing by them at some point and have a look. I might clear this area first just to see what we're working with. Because it's always nice to know where everything is. Uh, no, nothing. Just pine and spuce again. Where am I? Let's go back to where I am. I'm there. So now we're going to move into this area. Like this is quite a nice part because now I'm doing this. Hopefully you guys won't have to. Um, I don't believe the, the tree placement is randomized. I think it's pretty set in stone. Like this is what you will get in each area. So now you guys know the areas not to visit, which is handy, right? Okay, so we are in the area apparently. Uh, come on. Oh, it's by here, that's why. No, it's not, it's in here. Okay, spuce, no, all spuce. Not interested in spuce. So there's that. We'll hit this one. No, far right of the map. Oh, far right of the map. Oh, up here. Oh yeah, now they are what you call money. 4,440 quid. That's the most expensive I've seen so far. That one's 6,000, but that's, I think that's more to do with the area than what it is to do with the, the type of tree. These look like... So let's go check it out. There's a random area up there as well. That's proper, like that's as far right north as you can get. So let's go have a look, shall we? Let's go see how many oaks. I'm gonna I'm gonna see follow you. I'm gonna trust you here, Bernard. Let's let's go have a look. Let's go have a little whiz round and, and everything like that. And uh, let's put some music on while we're driving up there, shall we? Hopefully the music doesn't. Oh, that is dreadful music. Change of station. Right, let's take a little walk about then and, and have a look. A bit of music for you, just to keep you busy. Just to keep you entertained while you're driving. Like, I will talk all the way anyway, so you're... I'm just going to compete with... Where the fuck am I? Uh, going left is probably the best way to go. So we'll go left, we'll go around, we'll get it down. Let's go check it out. I'm taking your word for it. Just got a bit of my pepper while we're driving. Don't mind me. And I forgot to turn my light on. Look at me. I'm so unorganized tonight. I'm a mess. Oh, so how's everyone been anyway? So I, after you reminded me that the boys series was out. Uh, after you reminded me, I binge watched it. I have now watched the season three of... Boys, and I love that. I really do enjoy that program. It's so funny. Like, it, I was in stitches. It's just so comical, isn't it? It's like, if you were a super, if there were superheroes in the world, that is exactly how I can imagine them being like. Well, you would hope not, but you, you can just imagine them. That's, they'd be like, yeah, well, fuck everything. I'm, who's going to stop me? I do all the hell I want when I want. How I want, when I want. But that, no, it was all right, Chuckle. I loved that. I really did enjoy it. But now I've watched that, I'm now looking for something else to watch. And it's like, well, what, what the bloody hell do I watch next? It's like, oh, yes, mate, I did. I laughed so hard. 
Mate, it, oh, it was just had me in stitches. Every, like in every episode, I was in stitches through a lot of it. And like I was watching it while I was working. So it, it was just, I just couldn't help but get distracted and, and watch the boys. It, it was, it was comical. I loved that. I, d I really did love it. It was, I'm going to turn the music off. I'm chatting too much. Um, but no, I really, really, really did. I, I thought it was absolutely hilarious. Um, but no, the, the whole series is brilliant. And but no, thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed it. That's an oak on my right there. Is this for sale where I am? Yes, it is. Let's, let's double check this. I want to have a quick look here. Uh, pine and spruce. No, we're not after them. You can do that now. Sheep is called being a, a politician. <laughs> uh, the expenses are good on Amazon, but you have to get through the first series. Okay. I'll... I'll try that out next then. I think I did try and watch a bit of The Expanse. I can't remember off the top of my head. Um, but always looking for... I do need something new to watch. Um, so if someone's got something then... I like my comedies and I like a bit of action. That's what I love about The Boys. It's got action in it. It's comedy and it's got boobs in it. What, what more could you want? Like, that's like... Man heaven right there. Uh, check out each of the other plots up there. Oak of the rarest trees, honestly. I've made tons from spruce because it's plentiful. Right, I'm with you. Is it spruce we want now? It is spruce, isn't it? No, birch. Or spruce, yeah. Spruce is alright. Uh, birch or oak is what I'd really, really want. I'd love to have good quantity of that stuff going on right we're coming into them now uh, the first series is hard going but it picks up after they find a blue woman in the shower is that the space cop one okay we've got five oak three spruce and a load of birch and hardly any pine that is almost a beautiful, beautiful forest. That's going to make me some money. Only four pine in this little patch. And look at the size of this patch. It is tiny. That is awesome. Let's see what's over in this one. Uh, 84 spews. Okay, so this is the area you definitely want to be coming to. This is an awesome little spot. Let's go see what this one is. So we're going to go up this path here. I'm really liking this first one though. That's got a lot of oak and a lot of spruce. No pine. Well, literally like one or two pine. I can live with one or two pine. That is absolutely fine. This looks really rich for oak. 14 oak. 7 pine. Okay, I think this is it. 14 oak trees. And this is tiny. Like, I think we are going to buy this one. How much are we going to add? It's next to no money. This is perfect. So we can now just clear out the, the chop area and we're going to farm all of this oak. Start dragging this oak down and then get all the oak going through, get it ready to go in the dryer. And then we are living the dream. This is what we've been chasing a lot of oak. Oak is perfect. And having 14 logs. That's like, it doesn't sound like much, but each tree gives you a fair whack. You are talking, wow, a lot of money. 
Yeah, a lot of money in this one forest. I get those cheapest chips. So this is definitely my forest. Yes, oak, oak, loads of oak, so much oak. Oh, this is heaven. Right, let's clear all the crap first so we can uh, get around the forest nicely. We'll just go up to, uh, we'll just go up to here. We don't need to go much further than that. Awesome. Cut down oak. All right, first oak tree coming down. This is what we need in life. We need oak. So, and, and this is going to make a massive difference. So, massive, massive difference. It's going to be outstanding. And look at the size of these logs. This is like perfect. It's probably going to take me a few trips to fill them all up. But let's see how many are. How many logs we're going to get from each one? That's one log. We're going to get three logs from this tree. That's good. Okay. So that's 300 planks right there in just oaks. Wow. So that is going to do me a nice bit of furniture. A lot of oak furniture. Mwah. Perfection. Uh, the Orville. Okay, I haven't heard of that. Never heard of Orville. I won't lie. So if you're looking for oaks, head up this region. Thank you for pointing out up here. I have now found exactly what I want in life. Oh, you guys can't hear that. I'm so sorry. Because I'm not listening to it now. Because if I listen to it, I it's very hard to listen and talk at the same time. So I decided against listening, which is okay. May maybe a bit lazy. Now this isn't the oak. What's this? That's a spruce. I won't take the spruce yet. I want all the oaks first. I want to fill up on as much oak as I possibly can. I'll probably be able to get three trees maybe into that truck. Which isn't a lot. That's what, nine logs? So that's nine planks. So that's like 900. 900 planks in three trees. Yeah, boy. We're going to make some beautiful furniture of all this stuff. Of course, you've got to do it in order to make... As much money as we can. We need to pay off that debt as quickly as we can. Once we get the planner, it will be a lot easier. We'll be able to just decimate forests. Right, we'll just pick these up first. Let's see how we get on with these. Let's see how, see how much space these things take up. I'm hoping because I got the good size... Uh, Uh, let's grab all these little trunks then. There should be another one, right? Ah, uh, that's the end. It's only giving me two... Two... Uh, three. Okay, so not quite what I was anticipating. I thought that was going to be a free hit. But... Uh, Dude, that's still a lot of money right there. Considering it's, yeah, we're, we're going to make, stop rolling you stupid truck. Okay, let's, let's turn myself so I stop rolling. Jesus Christ. Right. Wish there was just like a handbrake.
maybe yeah we'll get three trees in okay so that's six planks well six six logs we got 600 planks I wonder if I can get more on that I reckon I can get one more tree in there. Let's go for it. Why not? Uh, this is an oak as well. And maybe if we cut it down so it falls this way, we can then just drive alongside rather than have to navigate a turn and stuff like that. I do love the look of these and the sound of them falling is awesome as well. Like they've done a pretty damn good job in that, you've got to give it to them. That, there's that. There's that. It's like if I, when we cut this first log off the end now, look at, we are cutting off a fair bit of wood there, that's, it seems kind of sad that we're losing that, that's, that's obviously so to just try and restrict people from getting so much bloody wood maybe, I don't know. But uh Okay, this should now this will probably now be the last tree that we get. Alright, come on in. As long as I can get you to sit on there, yeah, there we go. Alright. We are now oak farming, ladies and gentlemen. Oak farmers. Oh, I wonder if I can get one more. Should we risk it for a biscuit? Let's go for this one here. This looks like a nice size oak. Oh, I'm so glad you mentioned this spot. This spot is absolutely phenomenal oak this is some high quality of wood but of course in the uk it's kind of like very rare you get an oak tree you, you can cut down uh oak is a protected tree over here i don't know if it is in america but it is most definitely a protected tree in the uk we're not allowed to cut them down they're all protected Like, the only way that you can really get oak in this country, like good old British oak, is if the tree is naturally fell. When the tree is naturally fell, like one did in the middle of a, of a city centre down south. And uh, so now that is like oak for days. They, those, oh, we got three out of this one. Ah, this is a good oak. Ah, let's load up the other side a little bit. God, the amount of logs we can get on this is insane. Oh, mate, yeah, you, you've just made my day. You have totally made my day. This is where a good chat comes in. Getting tips from other people who play. I know, right? I'm landing it. Now, I don't think I'm going to get any more on that. That looks pretty <laughs> overloaded. So we're going to run these back. And then we'll pop over to the furniture store and see how we're looking. Over there for uh, our furniture. Maybe we'll chuck these through the sawmill, turn them into planks. Oh, I'm super stoked that we are we're in the position. It's a bit of a track to the mill, but uh, it is a massive track to the mill. But it's so worth it. Uh, I did inquire. Uh, I haven't heard anything back 
uh, from them. But it doesn't matter. I'll be buying the game anyway. I'll be buying it. And we'll be on it. Hopefully from release date. And we'll be done in that game. Like I, I'm really looking forward to, to it. It's, it's, it looks really, really good. It's got good reviews on Steam. So I'm convinced that we're going to have an absolutely awesome time. But it does mean that we will be dropping either the Tuesday or the Thursday night Lumberjack Dynasty in order to compensate and do that. At least for the one, one or two. And then maybe we'll go with it. We'll see how we get on. Uh, I'm no expert, but I have over 300 hours. Mate, I think I class, you, you can class yourself as an expert there. 300 hours is a lot of hours, man. Like, I, my wife does it to me all the time. Have you ever done that thing where you're like, oh, so I have spent 1,700 hours on a game and then you work how many days that is of non-stop gaming. It's painful when you look at it and you're like, oh my God, I have spent 30, 40 days of my year <laughs> on this game. 30 or 40 solid days. It's kind of scary. I wish they would not tell you how many hours you play into a game just for that reason, just for like, just to save our soul a little bit so we don't, so we don't bloody do all of that, man. I'm, oh, I didn't change my clothes. I come out of my work clothes. I swear these people need to learn to drive in this game. But yeah, it's kind of worrying when you look at life like that. Like you put things into everything. It's like, oh my God, I have spent two weeks of my life onto this game. Like it's only been out for four weeks. It's like, it's insane, insane. I hate it. So I never look at my hours anymore. Like I refuse to, I don't want to know. I've enjoyed, how much of the game have I played? Have I enjoyed the game? Yes. Okay, that's all that matters. But it is scary. It is scary to, to think of it in hours. Like, yeah, I. But that is a lot of hours. If you think of how long the game's been out as well, excuse me. I, I, like, if you think of how long the game has been out, it's been out, what, three weeks? That's 100 hours a week. That's four days out of seven. Do you see what I mean? That, that's, that's insane. When you look at it, uh, oh my god, that is not good. Right, there is nothing pulling through. So if I put these through now, well over 3,000 hours in GTA. That is insane. But GTA is a few years old, isn't it? So... So that could be kind of, that's fair. But uh, yeah, no, it's it's scary when you think about life like that. It, I, yeah, no, don't do it. Don't do it because you only end up depressing yourself. <laughs> oh, me beautiful eggs are going in. This is stunning. Oh, just look at them. I feel like I should get more logs. The size difference and compared to other logs is crazy. Hey, Matt, how you doing, my friend? Oh, how is work, mate? Not that you want to come on here and talk about work, but I got finished work, what, five hours ago now? Coming up five hours, five o'clock, I finished work. So. Ah, oh, look at all those big monies there. Big money, baby. And we still got loads of rope to get. What we're going to do is we're going to park this here. What I'm going to do is, I'm going to take this so much of my life. I know, right? It's crazy. And this is why 
you should never mention how many hours you got on a game because it would be painful absolutely painful my friend but fair play fair play right i'm gonna take i may as well take these planks over there as well just drill through these i may as well just get it done got as much furniture made out as i can the more the more furniture i can get made the better it'll be let's do it use all of these planks i could use some of these planks actually to redo my house i'll take one more truck load i'm going to leave them planks to uh redevelop my house rebuild at least start rebuilding the farm use the cheap ones to build the farm use the expensive ones to make some money i think that's a fair way to go from now on god knows how many logs i'm gonna need to uh rebuild the whole house oh hang on actually i wonder if let's see if it'll tell us there's a furniture store here isn't there uh, here you can buy new furniture or also sell the furniture you create in the factory so it won't tell me the price is here i'm gonna have to take the items in and we'll find out how much whoa easy tiger god bloody things going oh and i don't know whether you guys noticed it but we have now got a store on our youtube channel so i've got a store live got a, I, i'm i'm toying with um a second logo it's a bit simpler so do jump on the store and have a look at this this ultimate logo that i've created i kind of like it it's simple but yeah it's kind of i like it there's something about it so do check out the store the store is now live on the channel so all you need to do to get into the store is go on to the main youtube channel and then so across the top you'll see community store and all of that go in the store check out have a look at the new logo uh does your house have to be done to marry now you can marry when you want um i want to marry lily and i can't woo her at the minute i gotta complete all of her missions first and i can't complete them until the next chapter so once we're at the next chapter i will then be able to have a go at all of that business hey we got some beds oh god slow down let's pull out a bit so we got a bit of space pick up sell single piece of furniture at the traders Ooh. right okay so sell single furniture to the shop, yeah? Let's, we'll have a look at both. We'll compare the prices. How's that? Because I can imagine that it's going to earn me a shit ton of cash selling them to the traders. Uh, which they need to fix. Uh, I'm certain they will fix it at some point. Because no matter what people say, it's not right that you're earning that much more money you marry lily but it's a different lily Ooh. okay let's see what else we can build uh let's have a look at cradle sofa 18 planks let's let's do that let's have a go at that right we have got three crates of beds here. So let's pop these on. And let's go check out the price differential between the store. <coughs> and the trader. Okay, pick them up 
let's take these over so these are double beds all uh, right where is going to be the quickest way to go to get up to a store then probably is that class as a store no it's not any stores no the nearest store is there there's things there so that's what we're gonna head back let's go try them out oh I'm super excited to see how much money we make. Now, you guys really sold the furniture store to me. And you were telling me you've got to get the furniture store first. So, let's see the difference it makes. Now, I don't know what I'm going to make. No idea. In the slightest, I'm hoping to make a million pounds <laughs> off the bat. First three crates. Million pounds. Woo -woo. I know it's not going to happen. I'm in the dream world. Well, I'm not in a dream world, it's kind of, you can make new furniture for your house, the best way to top tier blueprints first, right. Yeah, so the only blueprint we've got at the minute is intermediate bed, um, hence the reason why I'm only making intermediate bed, um, but if you haven't got them, you're going to obviously have to do basic, but uh, there's three tiers, you've got basic, intermediate and advanced, and uh, so you just got to figure out uh, where should we try first? I'm only going to sell one plank to these guys. I think it would be really, really bad. To... Yeah. I guess we'll this out. I'm going to park here in a minute. So. Oh. I can't grab them. If then now I can grab it. Oh, you can't sell them to the trader. You can't do anything with them. Maybe if I get my that out. Nope. You can only sell them to the trader. Let's go see how much money we make. She seems happier after you do. Right, that makes kind of sense, doesn't it? Okay, so you can't sell furniture to the trader unless I was doing something wrong. Do let me know if I was doing something wrong. I don't believe I was, but... Let's go see how much we get for this furniture. I love this building though. This building is awesome. It's like goes from extreme. Okay, how much are we going to get for that? Two, three grand. Just short of three thousand pound. So in order to break f even, only single pieces to trade up. So how do I get single pieces? Because I have no, I haven't got the foggiest how I get single pieces. So if I do this, oh, I just make a single piece. Right? Okay, I'm with that. Okay. So we are getting three grand, okay? Now the place costs us 180 grand, so 918. So you're looking about six, 12, 18, yeah, six. So I'm looking at about 60 pallets in order to break even on the furniture store, which is not too shabby. Yeah, 60 pallets. Okay, how, how quick was that? Come on, you must be impressed with my maths, sir. That was like super quick. You're tired and you miss your bed. Oh man, oh. You can't drink or eat and drive, so you gotta get out. And of course I'm tired because I've got the wrong outfit on. I forgot to get changed again. Keep forgetting to get changed. 
that's fine. We're gonna nip over. Uh, no, they're, they're all gonna be making, aren't they? Jesus, Mary and Joseph. You took your time with breaking there, mate. Hit and run. Crikey. So we need to figure out how we can get solo items then. So basically, I'm assuming when you create, instead of bulk, you create one. And you put it in your inventory. So maybe what I do, I get some more pallets. No, I... I get one more pallet, and we'll do that for science. With a top tier blueprints, you make even more on furniture. Right, okay, I'm with you. But you get blueprints from doing the missions, I believe, if I remember rightly. Okay, right. Two things to do. No, I need to keep this outfit on, really. Not doing much thing. I see a few Amazons went on strike today. Really? Were you joking? I'm I'm I don't know what you've got me here. Yeah? Okay, let's sleep. Sleep the night away. Yeah, everything back up. It's the new day. Ah, okay, I basically can't, uh, I was hoping that I could, uh, <laughs> ah, I earn social points for removing all the furniture. Okay, so, let's go have a look, see. We can take over one more pallet and we're going to buy make an individual piece of furniture now and then hopefully we'll see how much we make in from the trader with just one single item instead of a whole caseload of them so we'll take over one pallet i want to take out on there because he looks lonely ah oh, fuck it let's take that one just quicker Right, okay. Go have a look. Now, these oak planks should now be sitting there, ready to be put out. Yeah, there we go. They're ready there. They go in the dryer, but I can't put them in the dryer until the dryers are completed. And then, hopefully, with all that stuff in the dryer and those ones that I've saved, I should be able to rebuild all of the farm. So, that's going to be something that I do. Uh, do you want to do that on stream? I can do bits of it on stream. I can do the whole rebuild on stream. Or I can do it off stream. You, you guys tell me what will work best for you and what you would want. Uh, top tier come out a level 3 treasure chest. Oh, God damn it. We need to do treasure chests on them. Alright. So I'm going to have to go and do that at some point then. Because I think I found like maybe one, two chests. I'm pretty certain there's a chest here somewhere. Let's go have a look. I don't know if this is the bridge where it is, but. Nope, I'm in deep water. Can't swim. Uh, no chest here. Okay. We're going to have to go on a hunt for some treasure chests. We're going to have to do that at some point as well, then. Alright, let's drop them down. You want to do the rebuild on stream? Okay, no worries. Maybe we'll do that next stream, then. I'll have all those planks dried by then. And we'll fill it up with oak and... About making oak furniture, I might. Do I save the oak furniture for when I have a tier three item? Ooh, we 
decisions there. The decisions, decisions, decisions. Do we just wait for tier 3 on oak? And we just use normal tree for now until we get a level 3 item. So before we go doing, as soon as those oak are in the dryer, we got to go on the hunt for tier 3. Right, that's, that's, I think that's probably the best bet. Okay, so we got three more things there, which is great. A bit more money, like two grand is, three grand is not too shabby. Not great, but. Okay, so go in here. So pine. And then if we go in here, create one piece only. Oh. Oh no. There we go. I got it. Okay, cool. Now I got a bed in there. Okay, let's see how much the trader will give us for creating a single bed. Here's another point though. Can you do this? So if I go in here now. And I go across to children's bed. And then create one piece only. Go back in here. I'm going to a cradle. Create one piece only. I'm going to a sofa. Create one piece only. Because now we can take three items for the trader and have a look at what he's going to give me the most for. And then we can decide what we're going to make in bulk. We we'll take these and sell these as well. May as well. And right. Science part two. Have to be a luck level three for top tier chess. Where's my luck at the minute? Uh, two. I'm only a luck two. I need more luck. I need more lady luck. No other Bernard, you're, you're kind of like giving me those duck shot, those gut shots. Like every time I'm like, oh, guess the, next time we'll do this, we'll do this. You're like, no, no, you won't, because you got to do this first. And then it's like, okay, we'll do this instead. And then it's like, no, no, you won't. you got to do this first. And it's like, oh, oh, you're, like, you're kind of pissing my parade here, mate. I'm only joking. I'm only joking. So we need to get more luck. So we need to figure out how to increase our luck. Must, there's probably a logistical way of how we increase our luck, but but we'll go with it. We'll go with it. We'll hit a flow. Yeah, you got you. This is uh the other thing is this just demonstrates like, of your hours and commitment into this game. It's amazing. Right, so we're going to make three grand off these. Right, how much are we going to make for one in here? Right, let's see how much we're going to make for just selling these one things to him. It's going to be interesting for science. Okay. Hello. How much are you going to give me, Jack? So.
So 128. 120 to 128 per item. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know. You don't get it until almost the end of the story. See, you, you, you just smack. There goes the next gut shot. Take this sheep. Haha. <laughs> In your face, mate. You ain't having that. You gotta do this first. <laughs> Okay, what I might do is grab some planks and let's just uh, do a bit of rebuild, shall we? So, we know what we're doing. We know what we've got to do. So now, we just need to start doing shit in order to clear up some space. Ready for thing. I should go and get some more oak. Maybe I'll take a truckload over. And then we'll maybe rebuild just one eye just one part of the farm. Alright, got you in there. Pick you up, pop you in there. Take one more over, there we go. Let's go build, rebuild. What should we rebuild first? What, what, uh, what part of the farm should we rebuild first? Usually I would say let's do the sawmill first. But, uh, in this case I'm thinking we're doing the barn where the animals are first. And I want to paint it as well. Hey, the first item is rebuilt in the farm. Oh, what are you doing, dog? Beautiful. Beautiful. Come on. Once I've done this, please remind me to change my clothes. I do love the building mechanics in this game. I know I say it over and over again, but God, it's beautiful. I should drink a coffee as well once we're done here. Like the way I see it, I'm going to be painting it anyway, so maybe I'll um, do the main barn, the main house in like oak. But uh, I probably won't actually, to be honest with you. Oak is bloody hard enough to come by. Like you would think like you would have like fur and stuff like this, red fur. And stuff like that in the game, but there we go. There's that. Right, let's go get changed, and then we'll drink some coffee. Let's get the worker clothes on, because we're working. 
We've got a bit more stamina. Change the name I want. We lumber the jack stuff. And then we're going to drink a coffee in a minute. Drink a coffee. Wow. Like, this building looks like it's been tangled. I guess some major tangling going on in this building. Like, major tango. Definitely painting it. So maybe what we'll do for the rest of the stream now is spend a bit of time rebuilding this. At least trying to get this one building done. If we can get this one building done, at least it's one less to do. If that makes sense, and we'll break up all the streams instead of having one stream where we're constantly just doing the thing. Maybe oak floors and oak interior in the house? How does that sound? That would actually be work. Like just oak floors and oak walls on the inside. And then the outside, you don't mind painting it because it's not oak. I think that would probably strike my fancy a bit more. But of course, everyone to their own. Like, like fair play. If you, if you do that, like, that would be pretty impressive. I need to do the roof as well. I'm going to have to buy some roofing. But I'm not going to do anything where I need to buy the resources at the minute. When everything so else as free as I possibly can. I don't like spending money. Me cheapskate. Wow, look at that. I'm almost done in this building. That's actually not that many plants. I was kind of anticipating it being a bloody deep bowl of wood. What's the next part? Okay, there's that. I don't know where I am, but... Lovely, there we go. Looking beautiful. Do downstairs before we go upstairs. Ah, uh, there's that one there as well. Um, there's no difference visually rebuilding with pine, oak, or spruce. All comes out orange but covered with no grain difference. Very disappointing. Yeah. Again, at the same time as I will, I can tell people that I've rebuilt my whole entire house in. That the whole house is oak. I'm sure that will imp that will uh, improve your chances with Lily, right? But that does kind of suck. I 
that really sucks actually. You think like there would like all the different things would have a different time colour grain and and stuff, but Oh. Yeah, he... Yeah, I'm, I'm slightly disappointed in that. Alright, let's keep doing this though. Okay. It has come out proper orange, isn't it? <laughs> okay, maybe I didn't really think about the interior when I thought, oh, this isn't going to take too much. Oh, what? Ah, oh, no way. Alright, let's do it from underneath. I did not think about all the timbers that are going to be used on that roof as well. That's going to put me into a world of bloody wood. This is going to be... Oak floors, I know, I was thinking that as well. How cool would it be if you could have, like, naturally oak floors? That would be, like... Like heaven. And I don't like how orange it comes. Like, I don't... Like, I feel like it should be more of a... Natural green colour than... Like a dark varnished wood, it's... I think if you want a dark varnished wood colour, you got, should have to buy the, the varnish to go with it. Right? No! And this is silly. They're going up these ladders. Look at this. Why? Fuck's sake. Oh, I'm going to give up on that bit. I thought I already milked them. Rebuilding is horrible. I think I've chosen the worst building ever to repair first. It's just a cluster fucking here. An absolute disaster. Uh, just trying to find all these little bits. as well.
Ah, let's keep crushing through this, guys. Yeah, this is the worst building. And this is probably the worst out of them all. But I suppose... If you want to start anywhere, it's always good to start the hardest bit. I say the hardest bit is probably actually just the most annoying bit. Trying to find the bits that you need to do in order to make it just doesn't fit right. It's just a bad luck. Maybe it's that one there. Okay. Oh. Okay, I can't repair that. Alright. Come on. Man, this is orange. Let's move this back a little bit so we can uh, put some scaffolding down. That should do. Uh, scaffolding. I don't have any scaffolding on me. These things just keep going, disappearing out of my pocket as well. I swear things are going wrong. Right, okay, you can uh, you can get on the roof to do the ceiling planks. Oh, that's good. That, that's handy. There's my way up. May as well put one there as well. Ha! Huh. Ha! Huh. I win. Beautiful. Look at the color. Wow, that is like tangled. That is awesome. Okay. Now we need to do this bit, which is probably going to be easier from the inside. But probably not easier from the inside. We'll find out. Let's go. Try it. Yeah, look at the colour in here. Now I want to try and get them as well. These. Cross beams, there's another cross beam here. Let's try and get this cross beam as well. Yeah, there we go. There's that cross beam, all the cross beams done. No, there's this cross beam as well. There's this last bit of this cross beam. I think that is it. Maybe is that it? 
No, I don't believe it is. Ah, oh, there it is. There, look. Oh. Is this fire one? Is it put me back on there? No, nope, that's part of the bloody roof. That's part of the bloody roof. That's going to be part of the roof. Oh, we've got another vertical up right there. That one maybe? No. Ah, oh, it looks like it's up there right at the top. That one. Oh no. Yeah, I got it. That one there, maybe. Yeah. One, two. God, guys, rebuilding. Why do guys say let's do this? This is three. One. This is like right side of us, man. There we go, we can get this bit done. This is great. We managed to jump through the boots there. Where's, where's the last one? Ah, it's up there, look. Awesome. There we go. Oh, okay. Anything else up here that I can do while I'm up here now? Yep, that one there. Any more? Oh, no, my battery's down. Now, these bits, how on earth am I meant to get these? It's not letting me get them. I've done all the chicken coop area. That's all rebuilt. So, everything inside is rebuilt. All I've got to do, oh, there's one more corner there, where's that bit? Oh, it's all the way up the top there, isn't it? I feel like I should be able to reach that, but I can't. So let's go around and get that last piece for free. Ah, oh, it's looking all right, though. I think it's kind of looks pretty. Hey, we got it. Found it on the bin. Okay. There's that, there's that, there's that, there's that, there's that. Like, I think when it comes to maybe these buildings, maybe doing the roof first, I... Well, help. I'm, I'm not entirely certain. What we'll do, we'll do it on the roof, as suggested. And then, maybe, and maybe, 
maybe uh, maybe if we done this first no nope. take that back falling off the roof and the movement in this game is so oosh okay i think i'm almost out of planks so that's kind of a knock out of plank oh can't i think i've used them all fine be like that hello roger rooster okay that not seeing anything there uh how am i looking food is low so that's the Hey, we're, we're getting there. And then we're going to have to drop off these planks, nip to the shop. I'm going to get some paint and get some roof tiles. And then this building. Will be done. Let's uh, got one more pallet. Uh, let's get rid of this thing because this one's doing my head in. Uh, let's see what we've missed. Oh wow, we missed a couple there. And that whole last side. Okay. So let's go up there. That's the only thing, isn't it? You can't really see where you... Got that one and that, that one and that's everything from there and now it's just here and there uh, oh don't drop down too far mate okay now it looks like over here now That apparently is everything. All done there, all done there. I can't rebuild this. I'm guessing that these things have got something to do with that. Do these need rebuilding? Nope. They don't need rebuilding. I believe that means that this building is all completed. So that is job one. Completed. Let's uh, use up the rest of these things. Just because I got them on my in my pocket, I may as well. Do some rebuilding. Got these other little bits done. Let's start with this one over here. Because I feel like if I was going to be yeah, and outside I would sit closer to the water than anywhere. Oh, I'm seeing the cats here. Come on in, cat. Let's get you a nice shiny... There we go. you got a nice shiny bench to sit on now. Beautiful. Uh, did you rebuild the cow feeders? Yeah, I think I managed to get them from outside. So done, 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 done there, done there, done there, done there, done there. 
All right, let's do this outside sitting just in case the cat wants to come and sit over here. Um, come on. Oh, my battery's just died on my controller. This means now I gotta sit like a fruit cake really close. I thought I put it on charge, but me being me, I I always forget to do simple things like that. Like, does anyone else find they do that? They just forget silly, simple things. And I, because I've been playing on PC a lot lately as well, you, you don't think of it. It's like, oh, because the TV, of course, you don't charge anything up unless you have a, one of those wireless things, but I'm not cool enough for wireless. And there we go, that's all done too. I may as well do this last bit, little bit of fencing out. Everything is so orange, that is insane. Oh, it rebuilds the stone as well, so a stone will look pretty and fresh as well. Oh, I'm off the bed, no worries at all, mate. I am literally going to do the, maybe do the roofing and get a bit of paint. I want to finish off this one building before I, uh, before I knock off. So, pop that in. Let's go to the shop. Got some bits, I want to get some paint, and I want to get some tiles. Uh, ba, 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 ba. There it is. Oh, I just follow this road straight. Okay, no worries, I can do that. But yeah, I hope everybody's enjoying it. Uh, if you are, please do smash that like button for me. It'll be a great help. Helps the stream. Really helps get the content out there. Uh, I do apologize tonight. It's a bit of a... a a slower one than usual um but that's the way it goes but um hopefully now next week what's going to happen is uh we're going to have a new game which will mean that on the thursday stream we'll be changing to the new game and then we'll we'll do this for one day we'll do a different game on a thursday and then we kind of just do a bit of everything a bit of a mix and break up the streams a little bit a bit of variety in life. Life variety is always wonderful and always good fun. So we'll be smashing that out. I'm a bit of variety. And grinding out the game. Right. Okay, let's go have a look. So paint. Right. Now the barn has got to be red. And I'm gonna put it to a like a light grey inside. I'm gonna buy two of each. And then chromatic roof. Is that the only roof parts they got? A metal roof. I I'm feeling a metal roof. We'll buy two of them. Three of them. Awesome. Okay. Right. Let's go see how all this looks on the eyes. Bang, and bang. I probably got way too much roof, but we can use it somewhere else. I don't know how we're going to look on the paint, but bang, bang. Oh, wrong way. There we go. Bang, 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 bang. Awesome. Okay, hey, I don't know how I managed to pull that off so lucky. I just kind of got what I wanted and it just so happened to be enough space. <laughs> Proper like that. 
Okay, let's go down. We're going to put the metal roof on and have a look at this paint. Now, the way I'm thinking is, is that the red is going to be for the building and then the brown will be for like, it's like a lighter brown. It will get rid of that orange. I really don't like that orange. It's too orange. It's going to be for things like the fencing, the fencing around the pen. Uh, and then the interior, as much as I can, will be this like, this great this natural light wood color that's what i'm thinking anyway but we'll, we'll see how we get on with it So let's have a look at this colour first. Let's whiz round. And let's, let's see what this is. This is red. Oh, that is just so much better than the bright orange. That bright orange is dangerous, man. Oh, that's beautiful colour. That is nice. I like that colour. That's a bit more of a... Yeah. Save your eyes a little bit colour. Much improved. Far, far better. The differential is insane. Right, you'll, you'll see what I mean by the brown in a minute. Um, I just finish off this uh, case of red. But that. Uh, I like this red. There's something about this color that is actually kind of nice. It's like a it's beautiful. This doesn't look like a tango building anymore. I'm probably going to come back and repaint those corners a different color. Have a bit of variety going on. Oh, that is just... So much better. Wow. Let's jump inside and get that. There you go. So we'll do that red. And I'll show you what I mean by the other colour now. Uh, what colour is that one? Okay. So. What I was thinking for this bit. Was basically. Basically. 
things like these but see ya like personally I think like this is the color that the wood should be out coming out when you put it on fresh it should be more this sort of natural wood looking natural wood looking color a bit more like authentic -y wood looking rather than having to Whoa, 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 no, 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 no. Yeah, I like that wood color. That's a nice wood color. And then it's things like maybe these cross beams. I'm being like the wood color. And then these interiors can be wood. Just to break up the red a little bit. Yeah, so this is what I'm thinking. Because I think that looks spectacular. And how it should be more and more natural. Oh, natural! Like less crap. There we go. There's that. There's that. Is that? Like, is this making sense to everybody now? Uh, see you later, KF. Uh, have a nice evening, my friend. So when you come in, it's going to be not red. It's going to be a beautiful, like, oak, oak-looking wood kind of colour, which I think is kind of nice. Kind of nice. Right, uh, what colour are they going to give us now? Oh, more... Uh, more the interior colour. So let's go back to the interior then. Let's keep doing this. Uh, up there. One up there. Beautiful. All these have got to be painted that colour. All the beams, all the gates, all the fences and all of that can be this beautiful wood. Stained wood colour. Ah, oh, that's painful to stare at, isn't it?
So I can paint them, but I can't. But I can't rebuild them. <laughs> does that make sense, does that? I know I keep saying beautiful, but damn it does. It looks this is like the ideal barn. I will paint these that color as well, so Just then I just gotta hope I remember what bloody color that is. Because I got a feeling I'm going to be running out of color soon. Alright, let's jump back out here. Uh... Oh no! I got the wrong bloody beam. Ah, oh, it is beautiful after starting on that. I know, right? Like, I honestly think that this should be the colour. That it should be once you put the new wood in. Far, 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 far more improved. All right, let's finish off the exterior again. I'm taking my time with this so I don't go painting the things that I don't want to paint. Yeah, you just gotta watch. I think the rollers are inside and then the paintbrushes are outside. You just gotta make sure you only get the paintbrushes. Leave the rollers. The rollers on here are going to be the sheep, the, the cow feeders. Okay, let's get this one done. Once we've done this now, I'll probably call it a night there and and go get some kit. Could do the doors in that car. See the stick now, the architecture in you is coming out now. Like you could do all the window frames like that as well if you wanted to. Doors and windows in a in like a natural wood colour.
Uh, let's jump from here. Ah, oh, there it is. Like, the, the possibilities are endless. We're going grand designs. I remember in the last game, I had done st stripes. And, uh, yeah, that, that wasn't too too smart. <laughs> Where the fuck is the rest of that one? Are we all in? Yeah. Okay, we need more paint. But you get the picture. That's what it's going to look like. So you go around and look at that beautiful natural wood colour. All wood interior. And then outside you've got this. This kind of vibrant red colour. I kind of like it. And then we're going to have a, a solid tin roof. Which I think is kind of nice as well. I could have went for a thing, I would have went for solar panels or something on them. But I didn't have any solar panels, so... Oh, I love it. Oh, we're going to go along the bottom again, do what we normally do. Or along the bottom is first. And then come back along the tops. Ah, uh, fuck. And now it's just this corner bit here. So we definitely bought too many roofs, but hey ho, we you've learned a lesson there. You don't need that many roofs. Yeah, that's it, isn't it? That's what I was saying. That'd be cool if we had uh, the other panels. Like we did in Farmer's Dynasty, that'd be awesome. And there we go, there's the roof done. So let's have a look. I love the roof, yeah, that's, oh, that's got to be a favourite of mine. Nice tin roof. Let's go around this side, because we painted all around this side. And look at that from the outside. Now that definitely looks like an animal barn. We are sorted. Ah, that was cracking. Right. That is pretty much all the resources I've got for now. So I'm going to uh, call it a night there. I'll probably do the finishing off of that building off stream. And I'm going to hit the hay. Got to bag that some kit. But ladies and gentlemen, I hope you have enjoyed it. I hope you, wait, you like what we're coming up with so far. It's going to look absolutely amazing once it's done. But I will be now back on Sunday. Thank you everybody for coming join me. Hope you had a wonderful time. Do hit that like button for me. Uh, we're going to need to make some more money. We need to get those oaks going through. We need to paint, finish painting this. And then start working on the next building. God, there's endless things to do. But we are going to get there. It's going to look absolutely awesome. You could even do the, the cat part above the doors in the wood color. Ah. Oh. Or in white. So it'd be like that red and white thing. But yes, ladies and gentlemen, thank you everybody for coming to join me. I hope you all have a wonderful night, day, morning, whatever time it is, is in the world. 
I will see you all on Sunday. But until then, have a good night, guys. Bye for now. Oh, cheers, Barnett.